hope all is well with you. Thanks for stopping by. I was just going to do a short video today on how to take cotton rope and make it 100% cotton because it said 100% cotton when I bought this, but it actually wasn't. So I'm going to show you how to take the part that's not cotton out and turn it into a nice uh, little fire starter. So I'll see you back at the workbench. It's been a pretty busy, uh, busy here on the construction site here to the right of me. Um, and uh, I think they got a ways to go. It's supposed to be done the end of summer, the pipeline project, but uh, it's looking like it's going to go uh, far into the fall, the way it's looking. But uh, anyway, uh, so when I made some char cloth, I did a uh, punk char wood punk char cloth and then I tried to do some uh, rope that I bought let me switch it down here got all this rope and then I made a batch of that and I just turned it into like a plastic kind of mess kind of hard chunks so uh, there was plastic or something in the middle and I took it all out this is the stuff but I'll show you how to uh take the plastic or whatever kind of material that is and uh, some of the cotton rope that you buy it out and, and and when I did buy this this did say 100% cotton and uh, it's kind of tricky because they can like oh no it's made with 100% cotton but got other stuff too so there's this little strand here you see in the middle so you want to make sure you got the whole strand and then uh, pull everything apart and give that a tug. And then you gotta pull down the rope, tug some more, pull down the rope some more. All right, and you get this big long strand that turns into a bunch of strands. And it's kind of, I'm thinking it's plastic because when it melted, it, it was like solid when I when I tried to char some, so. So I got all the plastic out, and now all we are gonna do is uh, dip this in wax, and uh, uh, and I've already tested it. I tried it in a gas fire, but I'll, I'll, I'll show you how I'm gonna do it here anyway. I got some uh, wax melted. I'm, I'm gonna be doing a, a candle pour, but I'm gonna do this first. So first things first, I'm gonna throw this plastic stuff out. Okay, so this is uh, all this rope. I've took the plastic out, and uh, like I said, I've tested this on my uh, my gasifier so I'm just gonna lay that on the uh, the newspaper give that other end a dip and just put the whole rope in there as far as you can And there you go. That's how it is made. I'm going to do the bulk of it off camera. Okay, and here's the finished product. There's a lot of it. This is a whole roll. I forget how many feet it was, but it was a bunch. And uh, pretty easy to take that middle core part out. Part out. So when you're done, you just want to get a pair of scissors and uh just cut little little pieces off for whatever or if you got like a big fire you could you know coil this around and start it and uh i use it this uh fire starter in uh my uh gasifier which takes uh wood pellets and wood pellets take a good amount of time to uh to start but uh this rope actually has a long burn on it long enough to to get those uh to get my uh gasifier stove gasifying okay so other than that uh it's a beautiful day weather's been good here hope it'll be better for where those uh, wildfires are um, my next video, I am going to be doing a spam timber 
video and I'm going to be doing an Asian and a First Nations indigenous twist. So you just have to wait and see how that one goes. So you guys have a great uh, week and I will see you guys pretty soon for that spam video. So you guys have an awesome week and weekend and I'll see you guys on the next video. Take care. Bye. Good evening. I am back and I figured I might as well uh, light this rope up and see what it does. So here is my gasifier stove. I got it filled with wood pellets and got this rope here. I'm just going to cut in a few little pieces and uh, I'll be back after I do that. Okay. Light this thing up. Okay, got her lit. I'm just gonna let that hold for a second. And I'm gonna put it in there. And I'm gonna light another one. And here is a third one. So they're not real big. Cut them you know, about an inch or so. Inch and a half maybe. Alright. I'll let that burn for a second. Okay, let's get a little bit closer. And so what will happen, this will slowly burn all the way down. And some of my fire starters, uh, it varies, but this... You can see there's already pieces of wood on the right hand side that are uh, flaming up. Usually takes a, a few minutes to get it going. But uh, I noticed this is a little bit quicker. And it was a good cheap way to utilize all that cotton uh, rope that I bought. Just took out the plastic and uh, yeah. So I'm gonna stop this and I'll be back in a few minutes when this thing is gasifying. All right, we got full gasification, and it took about five minutes. But uh, yeah, I like fire starters. I use a bunch. I will probably go through all that rope very quickly because I make fires every day, sometimes a few times a day. But anyway, so uh, this fire, let's uh, dedicate this to John Multimagnum. He's another YouTuber who has been having some uh, some health issues and uh, just pray that uh, he heals up and uh, send out good uh, good thoughts and prayers. Uh, just have them in your thoughts and prayers. And, uh, you know, we get older and things start falling apart. I've already have it, had it happen to me just in my 50s. So, uh, blessings out to him. So anyway, I already said goodbye before, so I guess I shouldn't overdo it. So uh, you guys have a good one, and we'll just uh, watch this fire for a minute, and then, uh, then I'll just uh, shut it down. <laughs> 